Hey, what's up everyone? Today we are diving into a side-by-side -side comparison of two beastly rugged smartwatches, the Amaze Fit T-Rex 2 and the all-new Amaze Fit T-Rex 3. Both of these watches are built for those of you who love adventure, extreme sports and just pushing your limits. But which one is really worth your money? Let's find out by comparing them. We'll start with design and display. First off, they both have military grade toughness. So whether you're out hiking in the heat or freezing cold, both survive even the toughest environments. But check this out, the T-Rex 3 has a larger 1.5 inch AMOLED display compared to the 1.39 inch AMOLED of the T-Rex 2. And it's not just about the size. The T-Rex 3 takes it to the next level with 2000 nits of peak brightness. The T-Rex 2 still does a great job at 1000 nits, but in bright sunlight environments, the T-Rex 3 just pops more. Both come with an always-on display and Gorilla Glass protection for added durability. So, you won't have to worry about scratches on outdoor adventures. Now, let's talk about one of the most important things, battery life. The T-Rex 2 packs a solid 500mAh battery and Amazfit claims a battery life of up to 24 days with regular use and 45 days in battery saving mode. And in my experience, I'm getting about 28 to 23 days of battery life on a full charge even after 2 years. This is one of the many reasons why I'll recommend this watch in 2024. Tap on the i button to check out my detailed review of Amazfit T-Rex 2. The T-Rex 2's battery life was already pretty insane, but Amazfit took it a step further with the T-Rex 3. It has a 700mAh battery and you can use it for 27 days regularly. This is perfect for those of you going on long camping trips where you don't have access to a charger. And for those extreme adventurers out there, the T-Rex 3 also has 180 hours of max GPS usage and it can last up to 40 days in battery saving mode. That is pretty insane. Speaking of GPS, both of these watches have dual band GPS with multi-satellite support. So you'll never get lost in the wilderness. I have tested the T-Rex 2 while running and it requires the GPS signal even faster than my Garmin 245 Music, which is renowned for its activity tracking prowess. But the T-Rex 3 steps it up with offline maps and contour maps with turn directions. If you're the kind of person who needs real-time navigation in remote areas, this is definitely a game changer. Now let's move on to sports mode and health features. Both watches offer tons of modes with the T-Rex 2 having 158 and T-Rex 3 offering 177 sports mode. But the T-Rex 3 includes some new options like high rocks race mode, free diving and ultra marathon mode for those extreme athletes out there. They both track your heart rate as PO2, stress and sleep. But the T-Rex 3 adds something cool. A readiness score and sleep heart rate variability which gives you more detailed analysis of your fitness and recovery. Alright. Here's one of my favorite new features of the T-Rex 3, AI integration. This is where the ZEP Flow Assistant powered by OpenAI's GPT-40 comes into play. You can control your watch through voice commands and even reply to messages using speech-to-text. The T-Rex 2 does not have voice control, so this feature really adds a lot of convenience, especially when you're on the go or mid-workout. Oh, and for the music lovers, here's something to consider. The T-Rex 3 comes with 26GB of built-in storage for your tunes, so you can leave your phone behind. The T-Rex 2, it's got 8GB of storage, which is still solid, but not nearly as much. When it comes to water resistant, both watches are rated 10 ATM, meaning you can swim or snorkel with them up to 100 meters. But the T-Rex 3 also gets certification for free diving up to 147 feet. So if you're into serious diving, the T-Rex 3 has the edge here. So, what's the verdict? Well, the T-Rex 2 is still a fantastic choice, especially at its more affordable price point of around $220 or 15 triple nine INR. It's rugged, it's tough, and it'll handle pretty much anything you throw at it. But if you want the latest and greatest with a larger display, better battery, offline maps, AI integration, and more sports mode, then the T-Rex 3 priced at around $280 or 21,000 INR is the way to go. It really comes down to your needs. If you're on a budget and want something solid, the T-Rex 2 won't let you down. But if you want the best Amazfit has to offer, then the T-Rex 3 is definitely worth the extra bucks. Let me know in the comments which one you choose. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more tech comparisons. See you next time.